Tap in with your ass, she is. What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Nico the Great of Ethnic Ass Reviews, Karaoke Issue More, Ethnic Issue More, the podcast. And I'm here to finally, finally give y'all that review of the Harold's Chicken St. Louis. Now, I am from the Chicagoland area, Aurora, Illinois, to be specific, but I know Harold's Chicken is it. And the mild sauces, to die for. So man, make sure you tap into this video, tune in, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, turn those notifications on, and just rock with me, man. Ethnic Ass Reviews, we're about to go crazy. I'm about to grab this Harold's. Let me go drive over there right now, and then I'll come back and let y'all know how I'm feeling about it. It's your boy, Nico the Great, Ethnic Ass Reviews. <laughs> Just pulled up to the spot, man. About to see, I'm a mask on. I'm about to walk up here. And see that thing? It's fucking line. It's 100 something degrees outside. But I'm about to walk up here, man. Stand in this line, see what this chicken hit for. Keep staying tuned, man. I have some more. Give y'all some little behind the scenes look at it and everything too. You already know what's your boy Nick with a great ugly. Alright, y'all. I finally, finally got the heroes. I was in line, it was hot as hell. I seen a lady with a mustache thicker than mine. I mean, it was crazy. But it's hopefully, we can only hope that it was worth the wait. So let's see. Whoa. We got the heroes. I got a six piece wing, extra lemon pepper, extra mild sauce. Let's go ahead and slide that bad boy out the bag. Boy, ain't for real all day. So this shit yeah, is looking good. All right, y'all, let me show y'all that food. See, I got the mild sauce on everything. That's how you got to do it. Got the fries. Got the six-piece wing. They got some nice-sized wings, especially in this pandemic. Wings out here struggling like a motherfucker. So, let's see. Let's see. Oh, here's a french fry. Let me try another one. Mine sauce is a little sweet. It's like tangy. Let me try another sugar. The fries ain't bad fries, but mm, I don't know, that mine sauce is a little different. All right, now. All right, now. This chicken kind of smack him. Yeah. It's chicken. It's a little cookie smacker. So, I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna get through the rest. Sometimes you gotta eat two pieces to assess your true feeling this tour, but so far, so good. I really don't like the mild sauce on the fries, though. I don't know. I usually do. These might be got dip. Mm hmm. Or maybe it's the fry itself. But, the mild sauce tastes better on the chicken than it do on the fry. Usually, it's just fire. I mean, there is a little skeet with it. Remember that shit, but I don't know. We'll see. You know what I mean? I'm a real chicken eating nigga. For all my real chicken eating niggas, don't let nobody tell you you can't eat certain parts of chicken. Man. Cause I'm good down some motherfucking bone. You hear me? You hear me? You hear me? Oh, man, who's going to 
Uh, I ain't trying to eat no motherfucking bone, but this is kind of cool. Oh, yeah. This is I'm not fuck this up. Mm. Let me see. They coated this motherfucking bread in there. I'll tell you that. Okay. They coated this right. And what, what, what a part of the chicken that they be trying to tell us we can't eat? Hold on now. Oh. Did I not get it on that piece or something? Where it go? I got hella chicken. That's one chicken, two chicken. Three. There it go. There's a pan of me. I don't know how the hell you first one. I'm like, come on now. Now look, they say it was fat if we eat this hard. Call me Ruben Study thing, because I'm sorry for 2004. I'm going to eat my part. Last year, fire. Fuck you. Your mama ankles. Look like moose knuckles. And that's on that. Let me go on down to this another thing. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You got real got smack them up. Come get the taste. Mm hmm. That's a piece without my sauce. Uh, that's the cheddar too. Too. Got your dog. You know, baby, she's a puppy. That motherfucker was on my nerves. Boo boo everywhere. I'll take a nigga outside. Get still on boo boo. Get a pit bull with an Australian shepherd. Take a head of a goof ass nose. That's him. This hard though. I ain't even gonna play. I like this chicken. Now, I don't have some chicken in my day. I call myself uh, a chicken kind of sewer. Of sorts, but that's one of my goals, man. I want to know the best chicken places everywhere. I'm trying to travel and go see them. I'm just doing a steak burger, so I'm just like getting the extra fat, bud. Y'all like this video? You got a chicken spot? I'm gonna get a six piece. I'll do a review for you. I like that. I like that! Y'all feel that shit like that. Shout out to Cutter Yellow. Mr. Hot Shot. You know, I'm a chicken smoker, nigga. That mild sauce do them fries. I don't know. I'm going to eat them. Got favor for them. Oh, um, yeah, thank you. Look, thank y'all, Harold. For put my bread in here. Melon sauce tastes pretty authentic on the bread. Who's the fry? That's giving it a little. Mm. But back to y'all appreciation, Harold. Thank y'all for putting bread in here. Because I'll be going to pops and shit. And when I get the honey, the honey hot shit, or whatever it is. They don't put bread because they give you sauce. And I'm like, what? They like that bread, man. That bread, you don't get all soggy. And I'm like, that bread, man. Your bread's supposed to get all soggy, nigga. That's the point. I don't know if I got this bread. That's doing good, y'all. I like that. Oh, oh, yeah. Mmm, mmm. I like this, man. It's hard. Man. And it could be the reefer. But this ain't too good. I'll check it out. Man. Let's go. Oh shit. I don't drop no good and drop a little bit of pain. Here, y'all doing good, man. Look, y'all make look. You want me to keep eating shit like you? I want do chicken for y'all, man. I like chicken, man. 
uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that little thing up in the top corner, man. You know, put the notifications on. Shit, you know, you just may have been worth the wait. Now, I will say this chicken is a little salty. Not like hell's, but. Definitely got a lot of salt. Yeah. Uh, high sodium. The, real, uh, sh the sugar's like what this. Yeah. But other than that, I'm going to take a bar. So I mean, you know, I hope you all have a good day. It's going to be June 10th tomorrow. I'm going to be in the Negro eating chicken. So stereotypical. But I don't know if I can do that shit. I'm just going to great. I'm black. I'm ethnic. It's your more. It comes on every Wednesday from 8.30 to 10 p.m. Central Standard Time. On my city, my music radio, but you can go to ethnicationmore.com and listen. I'm back to the chicken. I got a lot in this bitch. I am got not a man. What in this bitch? Talk dry. I forgot. I don't know. Hello. I'm back. <coughs> get some water. Oh, yeah, gotta get the label so. Don't give me nothing. Not there. I'm just gonna turn this backwards because I can't get the label out. Mix slick parched. Slick parched around this huh? Get my own labels. This did it. Uh -huh. This did it for me. It's the chicken for me. That good. That shit good. Very good. French fries look trade. Got one left. Finish that whole strong. Hot. That was hot as hell out there. Shit crazy. Be again messing and shit. I don't care. I'm clean up. I'm just gonna smack them. God damn, I can't even. Fry so disappointing. Can't mm, cook that whole lot. Mm, this is the best of the fries on Slangin' Game. This is a whole lot of chicken. Mm hmm. Mm, just that. I'm gonna get you. Mm hmm. This is a whole lot of chicken. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Couple of fries there. Yeah. Couple of slave remnants. That's why I call them. That's when people, you ain't got no money. So you got to double down on that part you ain't supposed to eat. And the slave remnants. Sometimes you got to make sure the chicken was good by that. Normalize starting with that. With the flappy flap first. Let's normalize that. Oh, this is a chick, nigga, look at this. is all in one. It's a fry with a piece of chicken and a piece of bread and just white on it. Delicioso. Mm hmm Yeah. That's fine. Mm -hmm. No. No, that. No, lemon sauce. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mild sauce. I'm thinking mild sauce. Lemon pepper. Don't let it go in time. Now, I'm wondering if the lemon pepper, but me getting the extra, is what was salty. You know, because that's not salt. Mm-hmm. Well, it was a little bit. Uh, oh, shit. That shit got me rather high. Excuse me, y'all. Excuse me. Need some more water. No labels for any pages. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. See, I got the eyes. I'm a little tired. I'm gonna suck my teeth, make sure no mouse off left unturned. I would give it, if I had to rate the Harrods, some, I definitely think the chicken tastes better than the Harrods in Atlanta. Let's just start there out the gate. That shit is something else. But, I give it a strong like seven and a half, leaning more in the eight range. I thought the chicken was fire. My eye itchy, y'all. Sorry. I thought the chicken was fire. Um, the mild sauce tastes pretty good. It gave me real feels. I know it ain't 100% the legit one, I don't think, but you never know. But it was cool on everything but the fries, as I stated a lot throughout the whole time. But the uh, the wings had some a nice size wing. Everybody else giving out skit wings in the loop. Um, the breading was fire. It tastes like the Harold's, you know, more so in Chicago. Definitely more than Atlanta. Um, but I thought it was great. So I'll definitely give it a yeah. Let's let's go like the seven point eight. I go eight range. Like shout out to the loop for this one. Whomever the owners are, I thought I saw the name, um, but I don't recall. Uh, but shout out to y'all for doing that. It's pretty good to me. And I'm from the Chicago land area, Aurora, Illinois. Uh, it's, de- it's better than Harold's in Aurora, and that's closer to Chicago than Atlanta. So let's start there, uh, for real. So definitely better than the slave room there. So I'm sorry, y'all. I was calling them that. Definitely better than the Harold's in Aurora, Illinois. But it gets you closer to the, the, the it gets you closer towards downtown, unless it's like a, some other states or like Milwaukee and shit. I don't know who else got it, but I fucked with it. It was pretty good. I would go back as long as it ain't 100 degrees and I got to stand in line. Uh, but I'd go back. I'd definitely go give it a try again on a rainy day. Um, so shout out to y'all, man. Y'all see we getting it in the ethnic ass reviews, man. We starting to branch off the food. I'm about to do music. I'm about to do comedies, skits that I've seen, or things that I thought were funny, just stuff I thought was serious. Whatever you guys want to see, I can do it on Ethnic Ass Reviews. Just let me know. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And tune in to more episodes of this show. Tune in to karaoke ish and more. Make sure you just check the most recent one I dropped with Grease Gutter. Shout out to you, bro. Go check the other four episodes prior to that. I'm about to work on a new one real soon. Real soon, I'll let you guys know who the person is once I get it recorded. And um, just stay looking out for more content. Definitely make sure you look out to Ethnic Ish and More. Comes on every Wednesday from 8.30 to 10 p.m. Central Standard Time on My City, My Music Radio, as well as ethnicishandmore.com is where you can hear it for real. So, hey, tap in with your boy Nico the Great. Keep going crazy. Keep bringing you this content. Let's go, man. Okay. Sing, I will do. Here I go.